Here I'm going to demonstrate how to set up a simulation with focus drilling. I've just got a, um, a line pattern with uh, dipole illumination and the trick to doing focus drilling is to enable the image averaging here. You have to have a customized stepper model and then in image averaging you check the checkbox here do image averaging and you specify the name of the variable that you're going to be averaging over. In this case I chose a variable called my focus and that variable I've got going from minus 50 to plus 50 and I'm using that variable in the projection optic defocus offset. Now originally I was just trying to go from minus 50 nanometers to plus 50 nanometers but I realized that it's not enough so I was playing with the range of focus for the focus drilling and I set up another variable called F and multiplied it by that. Notice that we set F here as a trigger variable so that when we dose to size we get a different dose to size for each value of F so that we can properly line up all of the process windows. So when you run the simulation here basically F is varying the amount of focus drilling from minus 50 to plus 50 times the quantity F. When F is 0 there's no focus drilling and when F is 3 there is a plus and minus 150 nanometers of focus drilling. And the results are here you can go into the resist metrology point, the FEM and process window and I'll plot these on separate plots and here you can see that as F goes from 0 and increases, I'm just going to use the arrow keys to shift over, that the focus window starts to increase the, the width of the ellipse at the expense of the height of the ellipse which is your exposure latitude and finally out here you've got your widest but with uh, only three percent exposure latitude okay so there that's an example of how to set up focus drilling using the image averaging.